unpack this truck I bought out a thrift store. I've been hustling and moving and grooving. There's my post lady. There she goes, bye-bye post lady. She's like, where's your packages today? I'm like, I don't have any. She's like, what have you been doing all day? She's like, she's my boss. <laughs> okay, you guys, I bought out a thrift store. I mean, a craft store, not a thrift store. I want to show you some of the stuff that I got. Hey, Susan. No, Susan, it's crazy. Like, I've not stopped. It's been crazy. Look at this. Look at this. Hi, Virginia. All right, I'm going to put you guys over here on the table. And I'm going to, I'm going to give you a sneak peek of some of the stuff that I got. Like, this stuff is, it's amazing. It's, uh, look at the chalk. It's full. So I'm just going to um, give you a sneak peek, show you some of the things. I have to go back and get another load. Um, these are all of the rubber, the rubber stamping ones. You know, the, not the wooden ones, but like the rubber stamping ones. I, I didn't even go through like the stuff that, um, that I got. I just, I just made a deal and took everything. They wanted it gone. They wanted it gone today. So Massimo came with me. He's inside getting something to eat right now. So there's uh, all kinds of craft books and rubber stamping books like this whole, look at everything's brand new, brand new, brand new, brand new. So this woman had a um, craft store, closed it because of COVID, and um, put all this stuff in storage. And then this is what's left of um, all the stuff. Look at all this. This is just uh, mounds and mounds of different cotton fabrics mostly all animal print up oh, there's a kitty print shout out to elizabeth there's another kitty print who's here hi dora hi frank hi scarlet i got my work cut out for me so this whole bag is just completely full of just all fabric so we're going to put that there and uh, I'm just gonna show you some stuff. This is um, this is like a crafter's case. Um, it's empty, but it's in great condition. I hope everybody's having a nice day. I'm not gonna be able to really read the chat because I've gotta unload this truck because I've gotta go and go get some more stuff. Look at this. these stamps oh my gosh beautiful beautiful name on them 1999 penny black ink berkeley california in her garden so just mounds and mounds of there's thousands thousands and thousands of stamps I'll stay live for a little while and show you some of it. Give you a preview of um, Pivot Point Stapler. I don't know, I'm not gonna open it. Some sort of, I don't know, more stamps, pens. I don't know what these are, but those more stamps anyways so this whole box again is just filled with stamps with wasi tape i don't know i just took it off let's see what's in this bin been hustling and grooving and moving so oh, 
Can you see it? Like I said, haven't gone through it. I didn't go through any of this. There's all kinds of papers. There's a box in here. More stamps. Okay. It's uh, overwhelming. It's a lot and it's overwhelming. Probably more stamps. Oh no, these are, um, I think these are those die cut um, cartridges for that, you know, die cut machines. There's a whole bunch of machines too, brand new. Everything is brand new. All brand new. This case is empty, but I took it because it's a great case. I left a bunch of cases behind. I don't know if I'll take um, the cases that I left behind, but let's see what's in here. Just all this stuff. Some more of that tape. This whole box is full of all of these, I guess, make your own stamps is what this is. I don't know. I'll go back and read the chat later. Maybe some of you know what some of this stuff is. Here's some more stamp stuff, some more tape, another box full of cards and embellishments and more stamps, all brand new. Everything's brand new. Let's see what's in here. I'm just going to grab box by box and look. or um, you know for that machine which I know I have several of those machines in the truck there's a bunch more stuff in the bottom of this bin as well alright let's put this over here and we'll keep going right? Thanks you guys for coming in. Hi Bobby. Hey T. Look. Look at all this stuff. Look at all this stuff. It's crazy. Crazy. Crazy how much stuff. All right. I left my I left my wallet there with uh, the key to my truck inside the wallet. So if I turn the truck off, there's a whole bunch of paintbrushes in here. If I turn my truck off, I'm afraid I won't be able to start it. And I don't know where the spare key is. I don't know if my husband has it. Here's um, what looks like a bunch of like bead making stuff, like jewelry making stuff. Yeah, all kinds of jewelry making stuff in here. All right.
here's another case more of the rubber stamped ones and more just I don't know paint crayons paint crayons what is all this stuff I have no idea just more stamp stuff just tons of stuff This is expansion kit. I don't know, maybe. These are just some cards, it looks like. And a little portfolio. There's clothes in here. That's odd. That's weird. Eyes odd jacket. Wonder how that got in there. The limited jacket. Polo. Some blankets, some fleece blankets. That's weird. I wonder how that bin got in there. I don't know. I have no idea. But there's that also. <laughs> idea what these Martha Stewart boxes are. They di I didn't even open them. They're sealed. They're sealed and they say, forget me not clover punch. But they're sealed. I'll have to get a knife to open them up. Okay, here we go. Let's see if I can find something to open this. see what's in these Martha Stewart boxes. That's what's in them. These Martha Stewart punches. I don't know, does Martha Stewart stuff sell? Anybody know anything about it? So I got a whole bunch of Martha Stewart crafts. Let's see what's in this box. Mini eight punch. That's what it looks like. No idea what's in here. I don't have time to go through all this. I'm just gonna give you a quick sneak peek because I think I might do um, mystery lot bundles. Oh yeah, there are more Martha Stewart pun punches. Must be another Martha Stewart. I don't know, does it say Martha Stewart? It says, tre it says trellis on it. No idea. Okay, let's put that away. Let's see who else is here. You guys say hi. So I can see, hey James. trying to beat um, the rain. Two bags of these threads. 
I don't know. Are they for like a special sewing machine or something? Robinson Anton Textile Company is what it says on it. So, yeah, two big bags of those. Oh, it's a memory book. Oh, that's cool. Complete with a glue stick and all kinds of die cuts. That's sweet. So there's a whole bunch of those. And here's a whole bunch of ink pads. And this is some sort of powder. Desert Tapestry Embossing Powder is the name of it. This whole box is full of it. All kinds of embossing powders. All right, let's keep it going. Whole bunch of bolts of fabric, you guys. Tons of bolts of fabric. more stamps stamps and stamp paper cards stamps ribbon punch things what do you think you guys what do you think of all this stuff crazy right couldn't pass it up couldn't pass it up had to go get it right away so I did kind of stamps these big ones some sort of paintbrush dove all-purpose it's like a nice one it's a whole bunch of paintbrushes a whole bunch of these stamps in here big huge big huge mega stamps the name on them is Carolyn Shores Wright I don't know. All different. There's all different names. Things. Oh my gosh. Things are falling out of my truck. Okay, so yeah. Another big box full of stamps. And another big box full of stamps. Just, this looks like a postcard stamp. Look at how cute that is to do like your own postcards. This one is the Can Mailman, Redwood, California. All right. Let's see what else. I'm gonna be selling stamps until the, the day turns blue more stamps I'm gonna take pre-orders you guys more of this all these like 
you know, um, like scrapbooking, just all kinds of scrapbooking stuff. More stamps. There's thousands of stamps. Literally thousands. More stamps. More scrapbooking stuff. More paint. More markers. More ink pads. Specialty markers. All brand new. All brand new. And I gotta go back and get more. Oh yeah, yeah. This mama bear is tired. Okay, more. Just more. Just more. More of this stuff. Whatever that is. This whole box is full of stamps. All stamps. Mega, mega load of stamps. have here some old ephemera some old um, road maps and some old ephemera and a ton of markers and more of that tape Reading cards and envelopes. The hot tub is filled with all different color greeting cards and envelopes. the machines that those pieces go to. Let's see what's in here. Let me guess. More stamps. Yep. More stamps and more ink pads. What's this? Front back lamination cartridge. Front back lamination cartridge. Brand new. Unopened. This whole box is full of 
ink. Brand new. Still packed. Still on not still not um opened. Here's another huge box of stamps. Stamps, stamps, and more stamps. It's all new. It's all new. Everything is new. It came out of a um, craft store. I bought a craft store. Everything is new. More Martha Stewart crafts. I don't know what's in there. Haven't opened it. What's in here? This is taped. Oh. Threads. Specialty threads. Another um, die cutting machine. I had to drive an hour to go get this, and I have to go drive another hour to go back and get last load. I was going to rent a truck, but I decided to just take my truck and just make two trips. Woo! Pretty stamps. Purple ones. Whole tub full of them. This is just, I don't know what this is, some sort of laminated something. This is, I guess, more stamps? Yeah. More stamps. stamps all right I think every time I say more stamps you guys have to take a drink ready starting with now more stamps all right everybody take a drink whatever you're drinking more stamps <laughs> how am I gonna sell all these stamps Piling it up. Piling it up. Piling it up. I didn't want to bring it to the storage unit because I really want to blow this stuff out and give you guys some great deals on it. drinking hi Steve Talbert's mom fancy pinks hi Harley kitten thanks for coming in you guys <laughs> this is my day <laughs> hi Anthony check under the truck I will a bunch of stuff fell under the truck <sighs> okay let's do it again Drink, more stamps. This one's so cute. Look at that. There's so many of them. More stamps. And more stamps. Did you drink? Alright, I need to get a drink. I am so dehydrated. I've been going at the speed all day. Oh. I need to get a drink of water. Oh. 
Okay, what's in here? I have no idea. Just a whole bunch of brand new, this kind of stuff. A ton of those. And what is this? This machine is in there. Some other machines, and guess what? More stamps and more stamps. All right, let's get back in there. Fit back in there. It won't fit back in. What did I do? It has to, ooh, risque. What's that? What are those? Ralph Lauren. Oh, here's a little Fiskars like cutter. More cutters. Just want to get this to fit back in there. Okay. That fits. Now we'll put this in there. And I'll put the cover back on it. Well, I'll try to put the cover back on it as best as I can do. And more stamps. I'm gonna take sl smaller piles because my back is killing me. So these must be like um, for the ink pads maybe. There's a whole bunch of them in here. And a bunch of new stationery type stuff. Blank note cards and such. And another box full of huge stamps. More stamps. Did you drink? I just said more stamps again. I have no idea what's in these boxes. None whatsoever. I'm not going to open them right now. Well, this one's open. Let's see. Oh, wow. So it's a whole bunch of, what are these? Like, are these iron on? Like, sh yep. Yeah, they smell like they're like iron on transfers, like to put on shirts. That's what they look like. It's a whole box full of them. A whole bunch. Okay, let's see. Use as a instruction, avoid heat or direct sun for use, foils, glitters, slicks, puff paints, etc. Simply buy yourself iron on transfer to be used on a part of a garment, pre-washed garment. Oh yeah, so they're all iron on transfers. That's what's in this box. That's cool. Very cool. I like those. And what's in here? Oh, some sort of cutter is in here. All right, and these are going to be mystery boxes. I don't have time to open them. I'm trying to beat the rain. Here is another Martha Stewart and some sort of 
tool cutting kit. And this is, I don't know. I don't know what this is. Storage clear block caddy. Maybe for stamps? <laughs> Could be for stamps. Could be for stamps. Guys, there's about 25 of these boxes in the truck that I have to take out. Thank goodness I have a big truck. So these are full of ribbons and stamps and cutters. and toolkits, mystery boxes, you guys. I'm gonna sell mystery boxes. Put down in the comments down below, I'm gonna sell $100 mystery boxes. $100 of mystery boxes. I need to get rid of this stuff I've got. I bought too much. This is a, oh, it's a scrapbooking book. It's Becky Higgins scrapbooking book to do scrapbooking stuff. More of these laminating cartridges. drunk or waterlogged by the time I'm done. More incredible stamps. Huge, enormous stamps. They all have names on them. So that's that box of stamps. And then here's, oh, look at this one. Isn't that beautiful? Can you see it? Is it too dark? Those are die cut blocks. These are die cut blocks? They're not stamps? Here I thought they were stamps. Stampers Anonymous. No, I think they're stamps. I'm pretty sure they're stamps. I don't know. What do I know? Oh, look at this one. Isn't that so cool? It's like a rolling pin. That's very cool. That's a stamp, Susan says. That last tube was die cut. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's see. Ta-da! Surprise, surprise. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Surprise, surprise. Surprise. Oh my God. Let's see, the names on these are, the names on these are, let me put my glasses on. Too much in rubber stamps too much in rubber stamps i don't know but they're really nice quality i can tell you that sorry you guys i got a phone call am i live again yeah these are um i don't know little notepads or just a box full of arts and all different brand new arts and crafts some crafts. Here, I'm going to show you what I'm up against. I still have a lot to 
one's home. No one's home to help me. Hi, William. Hi, Pammy. No one's home to help me. I'm solo. It's terrible. loading the truck I was trying to make it fun and and imagine myself playing Tetris <laughs> when I was doing it so these are a whole bunch of like um you know the specialty paper books that's what this is the whole box is just full of all brand new specialty paper this whole entire box here he is. He's getting something to eat, but Massimo had surgery on um I was supposed to take the girls gown shopping. They went by themselves. I told them that I would take them tomorrow. Actually, I think Angelina might still be upstairs getting ready. They were kind of disappointed that I didn't take them, but I couldn't pass up this deal, so. I told him I would take them tomorrow, and Chessie went off with one of her girlfriends, and I don't know how to open this. I don't want to break it. Um, pad grabber. I don't know. But this whole box is filled with stamps. The whole box is stamps. Anyways, Massimo had surgery, and he's got a bad finger. He had an infection in his finger. So, I don't want to push him. I don't want to push him so much because he helped me load the truck. And, um, sheet protectors, all kinds of scrapbooking stuff. So when he's ready to come down, he can come down. I'll probably have the truck unloaded by then. Arts and crafts. This is a bow maker with a bunch of ribbons in it. And this is bunch of catalogs, stamping catalogs. That's what's there. Watercolor pencils, chalks, inks, and then a whole bunch of those. Are these like stamps? Chalk ink. I have no idea. There's a box of those. This. These are those um, fabric paints. Well, I used to, my mom belonged to some sort of like club or something. It was like a, I think it was like a multi-level marketing thing and you bought, do you guys, uh, do you guys remember that? You bought like fabric paints and could color in fabric paints. That's what this is. That's a cool find. I like that. Very cool find. 
Okay, guess what's in here, you guys? First person to guess what's in here gets a mystery box, free. First person to write the word of what's in here gets a mystery box for free. Susan! <laughs> Susan gets a mystery box. <laughs> You're gonna get a mystery box. <laughs> Reminds me about it. Reminds me. <laughs> that was funny, right? This is, looks like miscellaneous stuff. Looks like some of her personal stuff got in here. Oh, scrappers, floss. No, this is scrapbooking stuff. Some stuff looks like it's personal. I don't know. I'm going to have to go through some of these boxes and see. Like, a brand new pair of little kids' shoes. Look at them. Earth shoes. Those are a nice pair of leather shoes. Hey, you never know what you're going to find, right? What else is in here? in here. Dispose of that. Yeah, this is a box of personal items. It's so weird. This is very strange. I'm going to put this aside and bring it back. Double-sided tape. Tons of this stuff. And then the whole bottom of it is filled with, with these. More stamps. Smokes. A bunch of these. pencils and just a bunch of markers a bunch of all different color markers and ribbons markers and ribbons who's here who's watching say hi I haven't been able to look at the chat I gotta take a break for a minute Donna do you have any stamps <laughs> Susan what do you think guys we're all here hi Saxton good morning good morning Anthony do you think I bought too many stamps hi boatman hey Jill all of us are watching thank you Jill you think I bought too many I love you too Susan Donna's auctions are going to be stamps lots and long, long time. <laughs> Not if you guys buy mystery boxes. Donna, you're such a hustler. I know. I'm so exhausted. You need a wagon. I do. Hi, Melissa. Hi, friend. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Look at all of you here. Hi, T. Hi, honey. I called T right away. Actually, I was on the phone with T when I got the call. I was like, oh my God. I said, I gotta go, I gotta take this call. It was like, right, we were still in the stream yard having coffee. There's a ton of this, um, you know, scrapbooking paper and cutters and 
punch punch board. I don't know. I'm not, I mean, I, I do some crafting, but not like this kind of crafting. This is a lot. This is a lot. This is heavy. What's in here? Books. All kinds of books. All kind of all kinds of like stamping books and folders and there's some bags in here and 24 pastel crayon pencils. Ooh, look at how pretty. Those are so beautiful. These are aqua colors. All brand new. Look at how pretty. Sergeant Spork is gonna be out of his mind. He loves this stuff. Okay. Let's put this up here. breaking through. I just made a little breakthrough in the truck here. Let's see what else we got. What is all this stuff? Adult poncho. Cardstock bundle. What is this? Red pepper spray. Look at that. Code red, red pepper spray. Let's be careful with that. She must have had that in the store. This is a Disney something. Paper and ribbon slot punching tool. An empty box. More checks. All right, I'm gonna have to go through this stuff, see if it's personal and return it. Medicine, dial van, don't know what that is. More ponchos. Okay, enough looking through this box. I got a truck to empty. Okay, guess what's in this box? Susan, you're excluded. First person to write it in the chat gets another free prize. <laughs> First person to write it. Who was the first person? You guys have to help me. <laughs> you guys are so funny. All right, you guys have somebody keep track of who the first person was because I couldn't see. So that's two giveaways. That's two giveaways during Donna's unboxing of her truck. How's that? Is that good? cartridge replacement for a sticker or something and these are all stamps in individual boxes you 
guys, it would be a miracle if I have an auction tonight with the way I feel right now. But I do want to sell some of this stuff. I gotta make some of my money back. I gotta make some of my investment back. This could be a big week for me, right? Once I get approved and I buy that cottage. Um, more paper, more cardstock, a whole case full of it. A whole case full of cardstock. And surprise, surprise, ta da! More stamps. This one. This has, oh, look at this. A brand new curling iron. Oh, and look, some Hallmark ornaments. A whole bunch of them. A whole bunch of Hallmark ornaments. Christmas around the world. This is a um, Perry Ellis, nice wallet, a wallet, uh, a chef's hat, how cute, and this is uh, Scooby-Doo's Adventures, and a whole bunch more ornaments, that one is X Star Wars. Star Wars and Barbie. So I'll have a nice, uh, I'll have a nice um, ornament lot. If I have the energy to go on tonight, I have to do on this. And I haven't eaten a thing all day today, which is not good. Yeah. I'm trying because I want to close it so I can stack. Okay. It's closed. Uh oh. Shoot. The truck just shut off. So I can start it. I don't have a key. husband will be home soon. Yeah, I don't have a truck key. I left my truck key there. These are, what are these? Does anybody know this stuffed animal? Anastasia. A whole bunch more of these. This is a digital cellular phone. I wonder if it's in here or if it's just stamps. Oh no, it's in there. Huh, I wonder if there's a market for this. Probably not, probably so obsolete. Some fabric, oh, and what's this? Oh, these are Anensco, rhyme with the drum. I wonder if these are Christmas ornaments. Oh, they're cute. They're like, uh-oh, something fell out. Oh, it's like a little piece of, like, turquoise. These are adorable. There's a whole bunch of them in here. See them? All right. We'll look at these later. But they're cute. Oh, some Star Wars stuff. Some more Star Wars stuff. This looks like probably a personal box. With like all kinds of just mishmash of stuff. Okay. Let's put it away.
You guys still all here? Wow, 71 of you. Awesome. This is another Martha Stewart, probably one of those die cut machines. Ooh, I love this box. I'm going to keep this. This will be really pretty in the background. What do you do with this? Oh, look at that. Isn't that so cool? That is so cute. I love that box. It's a really pretty purple color. You see it? Love that. That's awesome. I'm going to keep this. So when I do my backgrounds, that's an awesome purple background. And this is a clipboard with a box. And in here is, it's just full of greeting cards. It's just full of greeting cards, all different greeting cards, some Hallmark. It's just, I don't know what they are, but it's all greeting cards. And it's in this cute little box that has um, a clipboard. And you can carry it. This looks vintage, doesn't it? That looks like a little vintage piece. I think that's adorable. That's really cute. Okay, let's get some more. This is all cardstock. Watercolor set. I don't know, but this is all just cardstock in here, all brand new, different color. And then there's some magazines in here too. There's a whole bunch of magazines. So we'll look at this. I'll just bring the whole bin to auction. You guys can buy it. This is, I have no idea. I'll look at this layer. Whoops, I didn't break it. It's probably some sort of cutting board or something. Oh. And there you have it. More and more. more of these hole punchers hole punchers Tons of them. A box full of them this looks like some sort of cutting device brand new These are the clubscrap.com, the clubscrap.com, and it's got some die cuts in it and some embossing kit and ribbon and stamps and paper and I guess a book and some cutters so there's one two three of those but there was some other ones too and this is a mystery box oh let's see it's open it's um it's a bunch of paper it's just a whole bunch of really pretty like scrapbooking paper 
is in that one. This one, hi guys. <laughs> this one is, surprise, surprise. But it also has these, I don't know what these are. Oh, these must be to like attach the stamps. I, I have no idea. I have no idea. I'm guessing now. I'm guessing because I'm delirious. assortment of miscellaneous stuff that came with the lot. We can put that over there in the miscellaneous department. This is a health healthometer scale. That's pretty random. Maybe she weighed herself when she was at work. Here's three more of those scrapbook club boxes. If anybody is interested in those, I would be happy to sell them. I guess we'll have to come up with a price and see how much. Um, here's a brand new glue gun. And this box, this is like, this is an example of like a mystery box that I would sell you. It's just got a whole bunch of, it's got stamps, it's got punches, it's got a glue gun. It's got these foil things. It's got these staples. I don't know. I'll just weigh them and send them out to whoever's interested. Because you know I'm not going to have time to go through each and every one of these. Oh, look at this. So she's got Scooby-Doo in here. She's got a Barbie and another Barbie. 101 Dalmatian box. And then a whole bunch more stuff. Just a whole bunch more stuff. This is cute. It's a Disney, um, the daytimer planner. I'm gonna keep the Barbies out because I'm gonna sell the Barbies. So put those aside. And the Scooby Doo. That's awesome. Okay. Some personal papers, some more rubber stamping stuff. The whole box is filled with all of these, but also has some personal papers in it. That's what I'm afraid of, sending out a box that may have some of her personal stuff in it. That I would not want to do. What's this Krylon thing? Oh. More stamps. More stamps. All right, moving right along, folks. We're almost there. I think I can see the light at the end of the tunnel.
um, notepads. This has coupons on it. And it's Disney stuff. Oh, more Hallmark ornaments. More Christmas around the world. Some old stationery and some books. It's an assortment. See, now if I sold this box, I don't think you'd be happy with it. So I really, I just can't pick a mystery box and send it because what if you don't get a good box? Then I'm going to look bad. So I have to build, I'm going to have to build the boxes. I mean, I'd love to just send them out like this and not have to, but like, if you open the box and got this, you'd be like, I'm not. I mean, I bought it. I wouldn't be upset. This is an Indian foundation calendar. This is Mickey Mouse cookie molds, more pencils. You know, if you got this box, you'd be happy, right? More pencils, all brand new. Wow, look at this. This is beautiful. I don't know how to close it. Oh, hold on. Oops, I just broke the tip on one of them. Maybe it goes like this. Oh yeah, it goes like that. Um, more pencils. Look at all the beautiful pencils and crayons and stuff in this box. So this would be like a superstar box if you got this. More pencils and crayons. I mean, I'm sure these would sell really easily. Some crayons bunch of post-its and a whole bunch more stuff on the bottom. Let's just put it away. Okay. Let's keep going. more books, a pair of slippers, some sort of jewelry box, pretty random, right? An old iron, maybe she used that for the transfers, another old box, a laundry hamper, my daughter could probably use that for college. Brand new pair of slippers. Stoneware croc. That's a random box. Pretty random. No rhyme or reason what's in there. Paper, um, all different. Look at there's beige, there's red, there's white, all brand new, unopened. There's off white, there's pink, and then stamp after stamp after stamp after stamp after stamp after stamp. The whole box is full of them. I'm gonna stop because it's getting to be annoying. So the whole box is full of stamps and no cards. Stamps and no cards in this box. But it's a great box. This is a heavy one. Oh, very heavy. It has books and catalogs and photo, lots of photo albums and all kinds of brochures. 
just brochures. I don't know. Maybe she collected brochures when she went away to different places. Some Xerox copied stuff. Some pretty folders. Yep, it's mostly photo albums. This looks like it's all scrapbooking paper. Yes, it is. All different colors of beautiful scrapbooking paper. That's what's in that box. Another random box. Fabric, a tissue box, some patterns. There's a whole bunch of patterns in here and a whole bunch of books. Patterns and books. And this one. Patterns and books. This one's light, so I know there's no stamps on it. There's arts and crafts. There's a head bonnet. There's dental floss. There's a talking Scooby-Doo water dispenser. And this, what do you suppose is in here? It's crazy. It's all her, um, look at it. it's all her checks. So it's, it's a check box with the check registry. And then lipsticks, we'll throw those out. Unless they're sealed. Crazy. Yes, that's why I'm going to have to look through all the boxes, because if I sent you a box filled with some ladies' checkbooks, oh my God, <laughs> I'd be the top of YouTube. You guys would be like, I bought a $100 mystery box from her and she sent me some ladies' checks. <laughs> so I have to go through that. Okay. This is another awesome box. It has all kinds of papers, stamps. Um, it's just a huge mix. There's pencils and just a huge mix of, oh, this is cool. It's like an Oxford calendar. Just a huge mix of arts and crafts supplies in this one. It's loaded. Here's a box of more stamps and paper, brand new paper. And here's another box filled with all kinds of this kind of stuff and brand new unopened paper. 
so. Lots of paper. Lots and lots and lots of paper. Okay, we're almost done. Seriously, gotta get myself something to eat. What time is that, you guys? It doesn't show me the time when I'm live. Oh, more stamps. More stamps. I don't know what these are. Jewelry findings. There's some brick brac in here. It's just, just a whole bunch of brand new arts and crafts. Cutters, pliers, more pliers, elastics. More of those die cut cutters. You know, those cutting tools. More crafts, all different kinds of crafts. More incredible stamps, big beautiful stamps. More incredible stamps, big huge ones. Tons of stamps. and lighter my back is broken so garfield pencil opener what's in here more personal papers weird and here's a professional rotary trimmer put this with her personal stuff This is uh, some sort of guide ruler and stickers, a whole bunch of stickers, just all different types of stickers in this one, and this one's empty.
You guys still hanging in there? Yep. Okay. This is every color of the rainbow cardstock. There's tons of cardstock. A whole bunch of cardstock. And this one. Brighton box, but it's not big. This sounds like it's empty. Oh, it's not. Oh, what is this? American West Jewelry. Adventures. American West Jewelry celebrates the romance of freedom and natural beauty of an attitude to look at invitation expresses yourself boldly store jewelry in a plastic bag and wrap in tissue paper when not being worn store pews separately to prevent scratching clean with a polishing cloth when necessary never in, uh, in, immerse in chlorine silver dips chemical solutions or ultrasonic cleaners You guys look it up. Is this is American Jew? It looks like silver. Did I score? American West Jewelry. Look it up and tell me if it's silver. It certainly looks like silver, and it feels like silver. Do I have my glasses? I do. Let's see if I see a marking on it. Oh, it's silver. You guys, I got silver. I got some silver. Look at how pretty. Do you see it? It's like that liquid silver. There's a whole bunch of them in here. Ooh, let's see what else we got. That's one. No way. If this is gold, I'm gonna cry. Is this gold, you guys? Oh, it says something on it. I can't read it. I need to go get my eye. You guys, is American silver good jewelry? Donna needs to eat and drink something before heading out. I know, I'm so, Bobby, I'm, I'm like out of my mind. You guys, this looks like gold. Do you see it? Oh my God, it's beautiful. See if, if American West jewelry, see if they make gold, because it's marked, but I don't have my, um, I don't have my eye with me. My, here's another one. Oh, beautiful. Oh my gosh, you guys. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, there's a stamp on it, but I can't see what it is. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at, look at how beautiful that is. This whole box is full of jewelry. Oh, Denali, thank you, my love. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Denali. Another one here. Oh. <laughs> you guys, look at it. Ah, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's marked silver. Look. Do you see it? Can you see it? Yeah, it's silver. It's all silver. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> uh, all my hard work. Here's the cover. Okay, let's see what else is in here. Oh 
mean, it's silver for sure, but I don't know what it is. It's some sort of like little pendant or something. I don't know. I'll show you guys later when I'm on camera. Get a better view of it. It's called Penna. Penna is the name of it. It's a like Southwest, like, like an Indian, like an Indian jewelry or something. Uh, I don't know. You guys look it up and tell me what it is. Help a girl out here. What's in here? Oh, it's just a little, oh, it's Brighton. That's so cute. Right from the heart. Look at, it's Brighton. It's a little Brighton, um, it's a little Brighton pen and, and like paper thing. Here's another one, Brighton. Here's another one. What is this one? It's a cross. Here's a cross pen. Here's another really beautiful bracelet. National Monument pins. Just a brooch. Yeah, so that was awesome. All right, let's put it all back away. I'm gonna finish unloading the truck. Is that everything? And this. All right, so that was some nice jewelry. Yay. I'll bring it to auction. That was awesome. That was a nice find. Oh, my back. A whole case of all different color cardstock. White, multicolored, multicolored white, just all, all cardstock. You can see from the side of it. It's all brand new, unopened cardstock. Here is AOL, 103 hours. Another box of, you guessed it. And this is a create a sticker. Create a sticker. Coleman power strips. It looks like they're bungee cords. A bunch of rope and bungee cords. I don't know what we'll do with that. This is one of those Becky Higgins. It's not open. I'm not going to open it right now. And this is more stickers. Not that I can go anywhere because I don't think I have the key. The spare key to the truck. I'm gonna have to go look inside. I think my husband has it. And he's working today. Oh, cute. Look at these little, they're like little artisan little mats. Love is being owned by a Chihuahua. Some cloisonne pins, a lobster. Ooh, I would love lobster tonight. I haven't had lobster in, I want to tell you, years and years and years. Here's some tags, some cards, some greeting cards. Uh, 14 karat gold. 
Too bad it's empty. It's empty. It's empty. But maybe it's in one of these boxes somewhere. Right? Never know. I love these little tags. They're so cute. What is this? Assort uh, scrapbooking assortment. I don't know. And then there's a bunch of like um, bags from like Target and like um, the reusable bags. Now I'm hunting for more jewelry. That was such a nice surprise, wasn't it, guys? That I found that. That nice, that nice jewelry. Wasn't it awesome, you guys, to find that? I'm gonna take a moment. I'm almost done, I'm gonna take a break. What are you allergic to, trucker T? What is she saying allergic to? It's 545. Stuffed animals and making her mouth water. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> the crafty hen house. What are those? I never drank. I want to you off. Hey, Joe. Yeah, it was a good find, wasn't it? Just a lot of work. Oh, seafood. She's allergic. Where's my crazy cat lady fabric, Donna? Heard it's amazing. It is. There's so much of it. I have a whole bag of all... <laughs> Like dogs and cats, a big, huge bag full of dogs and cats <laughs> fabric. All right, fancy. Let me go get it. grabbed some at the top it's it's a whole big contractor bag full of it but it's stuff like this there's that one and there's this one this has got all kinds of cats on it but there's there's a whole bunch more and then there's dogs it's really cute and it's all cotton you guys it's nice fabric look at this one this is a nice color too there's that one <sighs> There's a whole big bag of it. I'll fold it up and bring it to auction. There's Dalmatians. And that. Yeah, it's a whole bunch of it. A whole bunch of fabric. Big, huge bag full of it. All right, you guys, we're almost done. We're almost done. Just a few more. I feel like these um, these boxes that are like random, like not packed from the store probably boxes, are um, personal stuff. But this isn't. This isn't personal. Oh, these are pretty little pine cone candles. Kind of personal. I don't know, she probably used that for crafting. And then, I don't know, maybe for, I don't know what any of this stuff is. Cropping blocks, country prints. random it's a random box of stuff we did it guys we emptied the whole truck. Oh. This is more of 
this kind of stuff. And of course, it wouldn't be normal if we didn't have more of these. And a bunch of paper. So that's what's in here, just more crafting stuff. And in here we have iron-on transfers. Ooh, lots of them. Wow, this is a nice one. Look at that one. Iron-on transfers. She loved her Indian stuff. And iron-on transfers. And then some more fabric, precious moments, and some Indian, and some cowboy. A whole bunch of bags. And just a whole bunch of other fabrics in here. Just a bunch more fabrics. Right. This here. Oh, I'll show you the bounty. So there you have it. This is everything that we just unpacked from the truck. And now the truck is empty. Completely empty. Well done. Right, Steve? I am dead, Elizabeth. I'm so tired. I gotta get a drink of water. And I gotta go back. I don't know, I'm gonna go back. I gotta go see if I can find the other the other key. Donna, go eat and drink quick. You have to be back at rest. It's almost, it's almost 6 p.m. I know, I might have to go on later than 6 p.m. I really do wanna go on though. I could, Lindsay. I could wait until tomorrow, but I told my girls that I take them prom dress hunting tomorrow because I was supposed to do that today. Um, yeah, you know what? Probably not. I mean, probably not. It's six o'clock now. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going on at six o'clock. So sure. I'm on now. I'm on now. How am I going to go on at six o'clock? <laughs> I'm already on. Right, Saxton? Get them to help you first and then go shopping. Well, they're out with their girlfriends right now. I mean, I really wanted the experience of, you know, finding their prom gowns with them. But if they find prom gowns with their girlfriends, I'm fine with that too, because I have to work. I mean, I just have to. No, Lindsay, he doesn't really get involved. He doesn't really get involved. I could start selling out of the garage, but to be honest with you, I am beat. $100 crafters devil box. Who wants one? When is the prom? May 1st to pay for prom dresses, right, Bobby? It's always to pay for something in my life, always. <laughs> you probably know about that by now, but I hustle it, I work it. I work it and I hustle it. Thank you, Elizabeth. No, I might go on tonight, we'll see. Family first, right, Barbara? I know, today I put family second because I didn't want to lose this deal. I thought that this was a phenomenal deal. I mean, some of those some of those stamps sell for a lot of money on eBay, and you guys have a great chance or opportunity to make quite a bit of money. Uh, if I listed some, I would have a great chance to make a lot of money, but you know I'm not gonna list them. No, mm -mm. We, don't park the gar we don't park our truck in, in the garage. We leave it out. I mean, we did for like a, 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 the truck before this one, we did for like a few months, but
What's the jewelry, Donna? Is it a good name? It's true, Christopher. Christopher nailed it. He, he nailed it. You nailed it, Christopher. I do. I do what I do for my family. You know, I don't do it for me. That's for damn sure. Just so that I can provide for them, give them what they want. But yeah, I'm so glad that I got, I was, you know, I wanted to buy a pickup truck and you see with all of the seats down, you guys, it's as big as a pickup truck, my truck. And I don't have to worry about rain. Um, I did, I did soil the ceiling a little bit with one of the boxes today. I'm going to try to get that out. I'm trying to keep the truck in good shape. If you go on tonight, limit your time on, yeah. Yeah, we'll see. I might. It's got a ton of room. Yeah, it does. It's great. I love my truck. I worked really hard for it. I got it last July. Um, I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to go get something to eat. Go see if I can find the second set of keys. I don't, I, I don't, I was going to say, I'll, I was just thinking to myself, I'll just stop and grab my some, something on the go. And I can't even do that because I don't have my wallet. Oh, does it have a five star rating? Awesome. Donna, check my other comment. Mary, where is it, honey? Somebody, somebody copy it and paste it in the chat for me. These seats go down automatically. It's fancy. It's got a button. Courtney, maybe there is. What do you mean there's no way I'm going on? There, there's a possibility. I'm just afraid once I eat, I'm going to crash. Cause I'm, I'm running on like coffee, nervous energy right now. Yes, Lindsay, I do. And I got to go get it today. We gotta get it tonight. It has to be all out today. Yes, well, sorry, Elizabeth. I went with the fancy model. <laughs> it's about 50 minutes. It's about 50 minutes away. And oh, there's more white boxes, and then there's like six, like, towers with the drawers that are filled with stuff I will buy the tramp stamp so I can take advantage of all the guys that are passing out right now from drinking for the last two hours <laughs> nose picking I do Pammy there's 80 of you here, you guys. Don't forget the thumbs up. Appreciate you guys watching. Oh, my phone just alerted me, little battery. It's okay, Lindsay. I called Susan, and she was going to a birthday party today, and she was sitting by the pool, just enjoying the beautiful Saturday afternoon. And I called Dolores, um, and she was hosting a little sleepover. Donna, I asked for a $75 box, 12 by 12 cardstock, sticker maker, 12 by 12 scrapbook. Okay, awesome. I can do that. Can you text it to me? Or maybe somebody can, um, I don't have any, anything to write it down. Maybe somebody can text me that order, if you don't mind, whoever has my, my, um, my phone number. And I'll be sure to get it out for you. I'll invoice you and get it out for you. If anybody else is interested, there's a lot here. I think it was a good buy. I, I'm, I, I think it was a really good buy. Yeah, I do. You know what, you guys, I looked at the clock and it was one hour, 11 minutes and 11 seconds. Right now it's one hour, 11 minutes and 48 seconds. I looked at it, I looked at the clock, I'm like, I wonder how long I've been on and I looked at the clock and it was 11 seconds. It was like all those 11s were up there. 
Thank you, Virginia. Thank you, Denise. Absolutely a good buy. Yeah. The stamps are amazing. They are. They're really amazing. I'm not going to look any up, but I, people have told me that the big ones go for quite a bit of money on eBay. Thanks, Fancy. Okay. I got to go find the key. Call my husband. He does, Elizabeth. Um, watch for my stream. You never know. I might go live tonight. If not tomorrow. We'll do an extended day tomorrow. This was very unexpected for me for today. Sergeant Spork, did you see all of those awesome pencils and crayons and markers and papers and... Hi, Dee's collection. Hey, Dee's, she never got back to me. She never got back to me. I'm gonna send her another email. And I looked on, on record and there's no phone number for her. So, unfortunately, that's sad. I'm gonna sign off. Oh, thank you, Janine. Did you give, did you just text me the order, Janine? I appreciate it. I can't, I can't open it up because if I do, it will, it will um. Oh, thanks, Nose Picking, for putting my phone number in there. Thanks, Mr. Turtle Trader. Catch you on the street. See you, Donna and Truck of Tea. <laughs> You're so funny, Elizabeth. You are so funny. Yeah, I'll decide. I will, Lindsay. I'm going to have something to eat, and then if I can, I'll go. I found the keys. Pencils, crayons, and markers for me, Moses says. Oh, you like them too? You like to draw in color? Steve, you like them too? You saw them? There was a lot of them. A lot of really great ones. Oh, right, Susan. I wish you lived closer. I'd love for you to come, come through my box, go through my boxes. You can take us with you in the car if you get bored. Oh, thanks, Fancy. You're so sweet. Yeah, it's like an hour drive, fifty minutes. All right, you guys. I'm signing off. Go get myself something to eat, at least a banana, something in my stomach. I'm running out of energy. If I stop, I'm afraid I'm going to stop, so i got to keep going. All right, bye. I'm going to go. Mwah. Thanks for keeping me company while I unloaded the truck. All right, bye.